Liz Truss sharply criticizes Kamala Harris for her performance as vice president, focusing particularly on her handling of immigration at the southern border. Truss contends that Harris has not met her obligations and argues that identity politics should not overshadow one's ability to effectively carry out duties. She anticipates that the current party will be seen as having failed, leading to significant backlash. You know, many people in this country say, uh, Prime Minister, that we have a problem electing women and that they extend that to say conservatives will never like women. Yet you're, you're proof that, that women can come to power in your country. Of course, Maggie Thatcher's proof of that. Do you think Americans have a problem with women in power? No, I don't. I think there have been some brilliant American women in politics, but I don't think Kamala Harris is one of them. She get, was given the specific job of sorting out immigration on the southern border. It is now at crisis point. She is not delivered as vice president, and she's got the job now because of the crazy situation with President Biden retiring at the last minute, even though everybody in America knew that he was not up to the job. So she has got the job. She's got the nomination or she's about to get the nomination in what is a very, very bizarre scenario. What I hate is identity politics. We shouldn't care if somebody is an ethnic minority. We shouldn't care if they're a woman. We should be caring about can they do the job? And she is not proven as vice president she can do the job. And I think we are going to see a situation similar to what we saw in the UK. I think there will be a landslide against the incumbent party because they have not delivered for the American people. Truss's comments align with conservative principles that emphasize gaining power through competence rather than identity markers, such as gender or race. This conservative stance against identity politics underscores the importance of ability and performance. Highlighting the role of accountability and leadership, Truss criticizes Harris's immigration policies. The public often holds elected officials accountable for their actions and failures which is a cornerstone of effective governance. Truss's forecast of a sweeping victory for the opposition resonates with the conservative belief that parties failing to deliver on promises will face consequences, reflecting a commitment to democratic responsibility and voter-driven change.